Boy, I'm really looking up in the sky today, huh? All right, let's see. My phone was dying, so I wanted to be here like, I don't know, 10 minutes ago, and now I'm here now because you know um, today is Sunday, and um, for all of those uh, people willing to, you know, watch just anything, <laughs> Game of Thrones is on at 9, so I kind of have to be done by 9, and... I need to do a few things before Game of Thrones, so therefore I have to be here early. <laughs> so there. <laughs> oh, judge me if you like. Judge me if you like. All right, let's see. Let me just make sure that I'm actually going live here. <clears throat> la, 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 la. I'm trying not to make you look at my the side of my head when I do my... When I do my... Um, <laughs> when I do my lives. And I'm always trying to set things up. And, all right. Oh, Scarlett is here. She's our first one here. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. I'm just doing my shares. Doing my shares. All right, here we go. <clears throat> I've been doing some research today. That's, I spent a lot of time today doing some research on, um, on SEO, which can be a little bit boring, but very interesting and very helpful in, um, if you are trying to build a business using Facebook. Now, <clears throat> I don't like to use just Facebook because then you're putting all of your, where am I? I don't see anything. Am I backwards? <laughs> you guys are looking at the ceiling. That is hysterical. And I'm just going, la, la, la. And Scarlett's like, where the heck is she? Does that work? <laughs> oh my gosh. That is hysterical. <laughs> and I'm just going on and on and on and talking. La, la, la. <laughs> and you guys are looking at the shelf. Okay, so yes, I do edit my videos before I upload them to YouTube sometimes because I have to um, get rid of the ridiculous behavior of mine. Oh, I feel like I'm looking warbly again. Is it just me? Now I think I'm being paranoid because this is a new phone. And I am trying the new phone on Wi-Fi because, you know, hi, Clarissa. Who else is here? I saw Clarissa. There was somebody else. Who was here a second ago? Was it Cody? It was either Cody or Charmaine. I'm sure. <laughs> All right. I just need to share this one more time. <laughs> I can't believe that I'm sitting here having a conversation with you people and you guys are looking at the wall. All right. What are you going to do? No, not that one. Wrong one. Wrong one. Is this the right one? Nope. I'm already on this page. <laughs> I'm all befuddled. <laughs> all right. Um, share here as me. All of these little clickety clicks that you got to do. It's probably so annoying on the other end. It bothers me when I hear people and I'm, I'm watching a live or I'm doing a tutorial. I'm watching a tutorial or something. And then I hear clickety clickety click, click, click. And here I do the same thing. Normally I'm faster. Okay. So here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Thank you for being patient with me. I'm gonna invite some people. Cody's already here, I think. Just inviting some people, just going down the list. Um, I say this every time because, um, you know how Facebook doesn't show videos to everybody? Facebook picks and chooses. And I, I'm, I wanna make sure that people who are my friends on Facebook, if they are choosing, if they don't like to be invited to my lives, because I do it, I, I do invite like, I don't know, like 15, 20 people. So if you um, do not want to be invited to my lives, then please just shoot me a message or ignore me. Either or, that would be fine. <clears throat> okay, I'm done with that. We'll see who stops by. Okay, so um, I thought you had us Waiting in suspense. Yes, that's what it was. Yes, I planned that. I planned that all the way. That was, that was already, that, that was the way it was supposed to happen. That's what I'm going with. <laughs> okay, so I, um, I went a little crazy. Yeah, I was home alone this weekend, so my kids are gone. You know, they're all grown up and moved out. And um, my husband went camping with the scouts this weekend. He's still involved in the scouts. And I was home alone. And I did get quite a lot of business stuff done, which made me happy. Um, but then, you know, I don't always get to chalk for fun. 
I usually, I mean, every time I chalk, it's fun, but I usually, I don't really get time to like sit and just kind of like, oh, let's see if that works. Let's see if that works. I usually have things planned out kind of sort of for when I do my lives. And so I, I got this idea in my head and I'm working on this big, uh, the farm that I'm going to be adding to today. So I did a little something and I think it looks cute. We'll have to see. I really should have done this as a live, but I just didn't want to have to speak when I was doing it alone in my house speaking. I don't know. It seems a little weird. So who's here? Rosemary is here. Hi. Thank you for stopping by. So um, if you are uh, passing by and you hear me and my bantering, yes, that's what I do. I banter. And um, you're going to get to see this in, in a few minutes because uh, that's what I'm going to be working on tonight. Okay. So. Um, just a few announcements. Okay. I have been participating with some wonderful, wonderful ladies who are helping. We are um, helping one another build our business and I'm learning a lot of things from them. And one of the things that I learned is that Facebook is, we all know is very picky and annoying and has like these boundaries. And if you violate the boundaries, it's like they squash you like a bug. So from now on, I'm going to try to remember to not ask people to click the button that makes this video go to other people so they can see it. It's that word and they don't like it. So instead of using that word, we're going to use a hashtag and I'm totally copying this off another designer and she knows who she is. I hope that she's okay with it. I don't, I don't think I asked. It's, it's not anything that should be copyrighted. Okay, Laura, if you don't want me to do this, like send me a, a message <laughs> and, and I'll stop. Um, we're going to give a hashtag every time I do a live. So instead of using that word that says you're sending it to somebody else, we're going to do a hashtag, hashtag that's going to associate with the lot, with the project that I'm doing. So today the hashtag is farm life. The best thing that you can do for me is to give me likes and thumbs up and hearts um, and then to send my video off to other people that might want to see it. When you do that, Hashtag farm life, because that's what I'm working on today. Hashtag farm life so that I know that you did that. And at the end of the week, I'm going to put everybody's names, everybody that did that, I'm going to put them into like um, a tub and I'm going to pull it out and they're going to win something. So um, I have a couple of ideas of like what the kind of things that you're going to win. Um, I have to be careful how I do that because I am on a public site. So it's possible I'm going to have to do that inside of my VIP. So I'm just saying that that's what I'm going to do. I still have to work out the details on that because I don't want to be put in Facebook jail. Okay. Now I don't want to tick off the Facebook gods. Okay. Two things that I need to share. Three things, but only two I have a sign for. Chalk time. It is chalk time at Trackside. I am doing a fun, fun workshop at Trackside Grill in Honesdale on Main Street, May 4th. 35 bucks will get you a double sided uh, sign that we're going to work on, some magnets as well. Uh, 12 bucks will get you a phenomenal meal at Trackside with their famous Smoking Saturday. So that's what we're doing this Saturday. We've extended the deadline to pay for this until uh, Tuesday. So you can either pay on PayPal or you can contact Trackside Grill directly. Ask for CJ because she's the owner and she's fun and amazing. And you can pay there. Or you can just send me, uh, give me a phone call. My phone number is all over my website, all over these things that I put out. Okay, so if that's something that you're interested in, this is what we're going to be doing. We're going to be, sorry, I'm not adulting today. Tomorrow's not looking good either. That's going to be on one side. And then, whoops, dropping my stuff. Wine Not is going to be on the other side. And we have some decorations that we're going to be putting on the board as well. Okay, so now I have my second workshop is May 11th at Jake's Tavern, Jake's Elk Lake Tavern. They've just done some work on it. That's going to be really fun right around Mother's Day. You can come and make a gift. You can bring your mom to make a gift. How fun is that? We are going to be doing the, oh, you know what? This one's wrong. We're not doing Why Not. We're doing the beautiful margarita at, at Trackside. This one's at Trackside. Why Not is here. Oh, that was an old flyer. I didn't, I didn't print up a new one because my printer's broken. So this also, 35 bucks. Light refreshments are included on this one. It's in the afternoon, 3 to 5 on a Sunday. So again, PayPal, just find the event. It's right here on my page. Click the button to pay online. You do not need a PayPal account to pay. 
All right, it gives you an option. It says, you wanna use your PayPal account or do you wanna pay another way? Pay another way, it's all secured, but you don't have to have a PayPal account. If you want to pay Tammy here at Jake's, you can call the restaurant, you can call me, and we will make arrangements for that, okay? So there's that. I have a fun workshop coming up at the wine room at the end of the month. That is, uh, that um, craft has not been decided yet. I have a lot of good ideas because um, I wanna do some different things. So that's to be determined. Okay, that's all the announcements I have. Who am I missing? Cody, did you try the music in the back? You know what? I can't because it's a business page. And so if I use it in any way on a business page, they can like shut me down. The same thing with if you do it on uh, YouTube. For, for cer there's certain perimeters with which you can say, I'm, I don't I'm not claiming copyright to this, but doing this on my business page, I can't. I probably could get away with it on my VIP page, but I can't get rid of it. I, I can't get away with it here. That makes me very sad because I did a search to, to find, I did a search to find royalty free or whatever, like, you know, copyright free music. It's pretty pathetic. I, 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 yeah, I'd rather have no music. Okay. So who else is here? We have some other, Donna is here. Hi, Donna. How are you? Donna had a fantastic workshop up in Sullivan County, New York. Oh my gosh. 22 people. How fun is that? And I was inspired by what she did, I might be doing something similar. Not exactly, because I don't want to be stealing off my designers. Um, I'll, I'll steal a, a, a Facebook game, but I won't steal from designs from people unless I have explicit permission to, to absolutely copy them. I'm not going to do that. But it was very inspiring. I was very happy to see that. And Franny's here. Hi, Franny. I'm trying to see who else is here. Okay. Uh, is that Maria? Hi, Maria. Oh, my whiskers. Yes. I'm telling you, when you people do lives, if you are self-conscious about your face, find a mask. There are all kinds of masks. I did a scary, scary one at Halloween. It scared people. It was pretty funny. You can do it with like blood dripping down your face and you're like saying, oh, I want to do these pretty fun crafts. Rawr, look at me in my funny face. But the cat gives you really cute um, cat eye makeup that I can't do and fuzzy and pink cheeks and funny ears. So I love, I love doing the cat. Okay, so I did my announcements. Now I'm just gonna do my announcement about what it is that I do here on my lives. If you are passing by, if you are watching this on the replay, I'm so thankful that you're here. If you're watching this on YouTube, I'm thankful that you're here. And if you have no idea what I'm doing, this is what I'm doing. Chalkator is a, a company that has developed adhesive back silk screen transfers that are washable and reusable. Chalkology chalk paste that go on wet dry to a hard finish and will not rub off like traditional chalk, but can wash off most surfaces with water so you can create many designs with the same surface. Want to make it permanent? Just give a light spray with clear sealant. We also offer exclusive couture inks used with the same transfers that is heat set to become permanent as well. Our products can be used on a variety of surfaces and give a clean polished look every time. A little bit of ad-libbing there. So that's what I'm doing now. Um, remember, if you are going to be kind enough to send my video off to other people with the S word that we're not supposed to use because Facebook doesn't like it, if you do that, put hashtag farm life. Comment hashtag farm life. I'm not supposed to use this comment word either, but there's only so many different words that you can come up with as code. So put in your response. Is that a good one? I don't know. Put in your response, hashtag farm life at the end of the week. If you come to other lives will have a different hashtag and at the end of the week i'm gonna draw a winner probably in my vip group because i don't think that i can do it here we'll see turning my camera now if you get nauseous look the other way turning it this way and then facing it down okay <clears throat> now this is a larger transfer so i have to make sure that it is up rather high so that you can see it i have my board covered so it'll be a surprise and you guys can give me your input to be like, yo, what were you drinking when you did that? Or, wow, that's so cool. I'm hoping that people will say, wow, that's so cool. <laughs> All right, I think we're good there. <clears throat> I think that's good. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. I have my pace that I'm going to be working on. Okay, so as I was sitting here looking at my fun farm, I was messing around with the flowers down here. Can you see them? I think you can see them there. Look how cute. I put little tiny purple flowers. I put little greenery around the door here. And I thought that that was really looking cute. And I did some here around our windmill. 
And this is all little bits and pieces from various transfers, which is what I like to do on these big ones, to show that you can use and be creative and check it out. Ta-da! Hi, Shannon. Thank you for stopping by. This is what I did. I sat here and I used the trees. I'm going to give the light because I think if I go a little closer, oh, that might be too close. Whoops. Okay, I'll leave it like that. I made trees out of one of the transfers, and I thought, how fun is that? <clears throat> now, it wasn't as involved as you think because I also used blue tape. So blue painter's tape can go anywhere on your transfers, and you can stop the paint from going through. It's really kind of cool. So I used the parts of this transfer here that has a larger like you know like a dip and a separation where you can distinctly see the trees see down here it's supposed to look like a whole bunch of trees like a forest but i didn't want the forest so i just used the parts on the top to make it look like a row of trees and i thought wow how fun is that going to be and then as i was looking at it i realized that um i wanted to put a fence and so it would have been very monotonous for me to do this actually on a live because, you, you know, I had to like um, do the fence and then wash it and then do the fence and then wash it. So it did take a little bit of a time. But the fence is this little part here on this transfer. So that's what I mean about Chalkatory. You can get so stinking creative. I have seen some amazing things. And this was so fun for me to put together because, like I said, I haven't really had time to be overly creative because I'm doing lots of uh, lives, which I love to do. But it just, you know, it's a different way of uh, a different way of focusing my my creativity. So I just kind of moved this little fence all along. Not too crazy about how that one looks, and I tried to get it behind here because technically I should have done the fence first and then put the windmill on top of it, but I wasn't thinking that through. So now we have a fence. So then I was kind of lost because I was like, well, now I have this fence and if I put the tractor on there, the tractor is gonna look gigunta and it's gonna look silly. But I realized it's not because I'm, the way the, the barn is here and I'm gonna put words here. I'm gonna put the tractor here and some words here. So I think that that's gonna balance out. We shall see. Now, a weird thing about our tractor. Um, I don't know anything about tractors, to be honest with you, and so I had to go and look online to see my tractor, to see what a tractor is supposed to look like. How pathetic is that? Okay, um, I have tractors drive down my street, um, which just still cracks me up to this day. I'm so, so not a country person. All right, so I wasn't quite sure where the red went, where the black went, and so... Um, I can't use black on here, so I have an idea of what I'm going to do, and we'll see if it works. I can't use black, so I'm going to have to get a little creative. We'll see. This is the second transfer. Okay, the first one is uh, Life on the Farm, in which you get um, this transfer, the overlay, this windmill, and you get some words. And then this is the tractor that you get the tractor which is so much fun. You get a little trailer that the tractor can pull and it says that tractor life. And what's really cool is that this particular little trailer on the back that I haven't done yet is the same size as our vintage truck. So all the add-ons for the vintage truck can now fit on the back of this transfer, of this uh, tractor trailer thingy. And I thought, how fun is that? Hi, Jennifer, thanks for stopping by. So glad you're here. Um, so that's kind of cool. And I'm going to be working on some Father's Day gifts using this. If you have any farmer guys in your life or people that love country things, I'm going to be putting together Mother's and Father's Day. I know Mother's Day is coming upon us quickly. I got to get that stuff together. Okay. I have used this transfer for the tractor a few times, so I'm not going to worry too much about fuzzing it, um, that much. I'm going to fuzz it a little bit. There's my fuzzing cloth. Okay. Because when you're working with a smooth surface, you want to put some fuzz on your transfers so that it just gives a little bit of a lighter stick. Um, especially with new transfers, you definitely want to be fuzzing them. The smoother the surface, fuzz it a little bit more. And then a little bit more. And if you're working on glass or very smooth ceramic or plastic, really fuzz it. I mean, you want to have a lot of fuzz in the back of that. I'm using our fuzzing cloth, which is really cool and convenient. Oh, I don't want to have that string on there. 
and um, works really well because the uh, you can use any towel. You don't have to use this one. But what makes it fun is, or, or I guess double useful, you fuzz on this side. And if you lay it this way, when you clean your transfers and you lay them down, this is really absorbent. So they dry really nice. Okay, so this is fuzzed. Now, tell me what you think. Do you guys like our... Um, do you like my little fence thingy going? Be honest with me. I can't do anything about it now, but you can be honest and tell me. Like, yeah, what were you thinking? Um, so here's the tractor. It says number one, and this means that there's going to be another layer to go on top, and you do this one first. So I'm going to move this one over, and I want it to kind of be the way this is over on the side, but I need to make sure I give enough room for the wheels, the big, giant tractor wheels. Okay, so I'm putting that down and I'm just taking the second part of the transfer and just laying it here just so I can make sure that the wheel is not going to be hitting the windmill, which it will be. So I need to move this over some because this part of the transfer is smaller. So it's always good to measure first so that you don't regret what <laughs> the decision that you made. All right, <clears throat> oops, now let me put this here. And now I think that we are very good to go. Okay, all right, I'm just gonna pull this closer so I can make sure that it's straight. So it's looking pretty straight. Now this is the outside, the, um, the motor area. And I've seen online that yes, this can be red. So I have my red. This other things are supposed to be, these can be white. And this all is supposed to be black, but I'm going to use gray and little bits of brown to make it look dusty. I'm hoping that that's going to work. I'm hoping that, oh, look at all the farm lives. Thank you so much, people. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, so I'm hoping that that's going to work. Now, you always want to work with the larger part of the transfer first because that's going to take the longest to dry. I can do the peel method if I, if I feel that this is going to start to dry before I get to these other ones. And, and, um, I can show how that works. I, I'm fair, fairly confident that this is going to be um, an okay thing. So I'm just scooping up my red paste and I'm putting more on here than I know that, I, that I'm pretty sure I'm going to need. This is a larger transfer, but I want to kind of put it on thick because I'm going to leave it sit there while I'm working on the other part of the tractor. If you leave it on there a little thick, it is not going to dry as quickly, and I should be okay to go. I do need to get a new red. Look at that. <clears throat> All right, and I'm going to do the wheels are going to be in this gray-brown because I want it to look like there's dust on them, and everything on my farm Everything on a tractor can be dusty. And I was looking, I was like, well, it kind of looks gray. So we'll, we'll see, we'll see. I have my storm here and I have some light brown here. So we're gonna see how this is gonna go. I'm gonna stand up so I can fit it better. If you see the top of my head, I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, um, yeah, I'm gonna do the wheels in gray. Again, putting it on way thicker than I need, and then I can do a quick swipe before I pull it off. Okay. All right. Um, I opted not even to put any brown on there because I think I don't want to make it too, I don't want to make it too busy. So we'll have to see. I'm gonna move the brown over. Look, I got, I got a drip on there. Okay, I'm getting a clean squeegee here and I'm gonna squeegee off the red. <clears throat> and I'm gonna put the excess back into the jar. I really don't use a lot. So we're gonna to have to see how this girl from Brooklyn figures out <laughs> how to make a tractor. All right, so I'm gonna take this off here. Now I see, uh-oh, I got some red. No, 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 no. I think that's off the pad. I think that's off of it. Oops, scrape it in the right one, Donna. 
Okay, I see that part of this is starting to dry, so I'm just gonna peel this off. I don't want it to dry in the transfer. Okay. I'm going to scrape this here. I really just like to have fun with the with the transfers. They are a lot of fun. You can be so creative. I've seen some amazing things. If you ever need some inspiration, do a search for Chocotour ideas. Okay, here we go. All right, there we go. So that's the outside. It doesn't really look like much, but it's gonna look like more when I do the second layer. Just putting this in the water here. I had such great responses last week from my five from one. So I am going to be continuing that series starting tomorrow. And that's five from one showing you five different projects that you can do with one transfer to show that buying a $15 transfer really does go a long way. You can do several projects. If you contact me, I sell the individual paste singles. So you can get a bunch of colors with one transfer, which is kind of cool. And that makes it more versatile as well. Versatile, that just sounded like so she-she. Okay, I need my blow dryer because this must be dried. It's a little bit more of an open transfer here, so I really wanted to make sure that it's dry. So that's why I'm just taking an extra couple of seconds to do that. Okay, so that's looking pretty good. I did have some spots here, so that just needs to be uh, cleaned off at a later time. <clears throat> I'm not going to worry about it just yet. So, this is the second part of the transfer. Okay, and on here, I'm going to make sure that I put some brown as well on the big wheel. So, we'll have to see how this goes. I mean, it's kind of hard to not do black on, one of the, on the tractor, but we'll have to see. I wonder if I can do it in white, although I don't think. Yep, tractor time. I'm just trying to look to make sure that I didn't forget anybody. Here we are. Yay, hello, hello. Okay, so um, on a scale of 1 to 10, be honest. What are you thinking about the fence? Do you think that it looks okay? And I mean, this looks like it's going to be flying in the air up here, but I'm hoping that when I put the words, it's going to kind of like cut it in half. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. On a scale, did I fuzz this? I did fuzz it. On a scale of one to ten, one being like, wow, what were you drinking when you were home alone doing that project? And ten being, oh my gosh, that's amazing. <laughs> okay, all dry. All right, I'm going to line this up. Excuse the top of my head if that's what you're seeing. Okay. I could have used the guide marks, but this is a super easy one to line up. So I'm not, I'm not overly concerned with getting it. Oops. Of course, yeah. I just made a big fat liar out of myself. Whatever. <clears throat> okay, here we go. That doesn't look right, does it? That one looks right right here. And then that's what I get for showing off and thinking, I don't need any guidelines. What do I need any guidelines for? Too funny. 
All right, I should have done the guidelines. The guidelines are little dots on either side of the transfer. Oh, there's something on here. Wah, wah, wah. Um, that would help me to line this up a little bit easier. But that's what I have. Oops, something else on the transfer here. You don't have to worry about too much with debris unless it's on the transfer part itself. Okay, so this is going to be brown and gray, making it look like it's dusty. Fingers crossed. In my mind's eye, it worked. Okay, I'm going to put some brown and I'm going to try to put it in. This is my mate, my personally made brown that got mixed up with my white, but it's a great color. All right, I'm going to put some lines this way to make it look like, um, are you guys here? Okay, now I have to give it a second to see if you're still here because it paused for a second. Um, somebody, somebody do something so that I know you guys are here. Um, my, my phone was going to update because it's a new phone. So it paused. Um, what I did was put stripes of brown and I put gray over it. I didn't notice when it paused. So, um, let's see. I think it looks kind of cool, actually. I think it's working. I think it works. What do you guys think? Do you think it works? I wish that it could be black on the top or, or the other portion to be black, but I think it works. <clears throat> I definitely am okay with that. I can see the brown spots better. Let me see if I can get you guys closer. I'm back now, right? <laughs> My phone... They, they replaced my phone. All right, can you see that a little bit better now? Let's see. You can see that I put like like brown on it to make it look dirty, to make it look like there's like dirt on it. I don't know if you can tell that on the thing. I can see it clearly here as I'm working on that. <clears throat> okay, so what's my time? I started at 10 of, and I'm just about half an hour in. Part of me wants to add the words, part of me doesn't, because I want to kind of stretch this out a little bit more, but I am going to put some other things, some other greenery and stuff around the, the tractor, not to leave it plain up there, so it looks like there's like a giant tractor flying in the sky, like, um, <laughs> like Ron and Harry Potter when they're in Mr. Weasley's stolen flying car. <laughs> so, so there we go. Okay, Franny gave me a 10. Yay, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Thumbs up, hearts, excellent. Now, you know the difference between the heart. You can click the heart that is above to the right or wherever it is on your phone, I don't know, um, where you can uh, just click the regular like. But then there's the bubble likes and hearts and happy faces that are under the picture. Facebook loves those. Loves the hearts and the happy faces. So... It's crazy how we are just so reliant on the decisions that Mr. Zuckerberg and his cronies make. So here, ah, somebody found it. I'm clicking the loves a couple of times um, and it sends up the bubbles. There we go. Okay. I don't think it makes, I don't think it helps if I am the one that's doing the lights and the hearts. I was just showing that as an example. And if you are passing by and you are new here, you can also click the bell. You can click to be notified the next time that I go live. Okay, now I have my words and that would be kind of cool. The words that I have are life, uh, life is better on the farm. So I thought that I was gonna put those somewhere around here. And then I have <clears throat> the words here. Oops, well, I don't wanna rip that. Okay, <clears throat> the words here that says that tractor life. So I thought if I put those words on there in my mind, it was like, oh, that kind of like separates it a little bit, right? So I can put life is better on the farm like that. No, I can put, I can put this as far over as here. Life is better on the farm. I'm thinking that that is gonna look better. Okay, so I'm thinking that's gonna look good. 
Now the question is, what color should I do? Do I keep it with red? Do I do the farm in red? Do I do the words in white? Do I do one of the colors that I have here, like the yellow or purple? I don't think that purple is gonna work. I don't think that purple is gonna work. Um, I like the idea of tractor, the word tractor being in red, and I could do that in gray. So maybe, oh see, so it would be gray, red, then gray and red. That works. I think that works. I think that works. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm gonna do the words down here first. I need to clean that off. Okay, so I'm gonna use, I think I'm, no, you know what, I'm gonna use white because I want the white, I want it to stand out. I'm gonna use white for the words. Okay, so if anybody has an objection to me using white, <laughs> you have about 12 seconds to, to make me stop. <laughs> Okay, I'm putting this as far over as I can. You can kind of see, because the silk screen, you can see it, you can see if there's um, anything showing through, then it is going to be on the fence or on that, and I don't want it, I want it to be next to it. Okay, so I'm going for the white, and if I hate it, I'll wash it off. We're going for the white. I need to have time to go and take a shower and make popcorn before <laughs> before Game of Thrones. Ay, ay, ay. <clears throat> okay, this will be super easy. Look at how easy that is. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. Life is better. Life is better on, and then I'm going to do the farm in red, but I'm going to put this up on top. This needs to be, see how easy it is to clean this off? I just kind of scrape it off there. There we go. Um, <clears throat> where is my little cloth? They have right here. I literally just sprayed a tiny bit on, on the, the end of this towel just to make sure that it's all cleaned nicely. There, you can see that drying off nicely. All right. You don't want your surfaces or your transfers. You should put the hot air balloon. I was thinking of that, Cody. Remember, I said the other day that I was gonna that I was thinking of putting the balloon the balloons on this. That is the one of the embellishments that I want to do. Very very cool. Great minds, great minds think alike, my friend. Definitely going to be happening. I'm just going to finish the words today, and then I'm going to add some other stuff in a couple days because I want to try to make this. I'll try to make it last. Now, since hmm, this goes here, and this is cute because it says that tractor life. Of course, every time I hear something with the word tractor in it that way, I think of Kenny Tre Kenny Chesney's song. She thinks my tractor sexy. I gotta tell you, the first time I heard that song, I was like, "What? What is he saying? What is he saying?" Because. The first time I ever saw a tractor up close, I think, was when I moved here when I was, like, in my 30s. I mean, I knew what a tractor was. It was I wasn't that isolated, but <laughs> she thinks my tractor's sexy. All right, buddy. And I have since fallen in love with Kenny Chesney and his amazing music. Okay. I'm doing peel and dry because I want to peel this and let that dry. That came out nice. I'm just going to sit that there to hold it down. Maybe I'll sit it over here to hold it down. Okay, and now I'm gonna put the farm here. We are almost ready. There we go. I'm hoping that the picture is really clear for you guys now, because my phone issues were making me crazy, but now I have my new phone. There we go. And it looks really clear on my end, so I'm hoping that it looks as clear on your end as it does on mine. Okay, put a little bit of paste on there. 
my paste, this paste is older, so it doesn't work as smoothly simply because I do so much with it and I sometimes leave my paste open and they get lumps in them. The lumps don't ruin the paste. You can move the lumps and work around it. All right, there we go. Oh, look how cute. And I love how the transfer makes it look modeled like that. I don't know if you can tell, but that's that's part of the transfer that makes it look like like it's worn, like it's vintagey. It's really kind of cool. Okay. That is going to be dry enough because I'm not going to be tapping it. So how'd that happen? Huh? Oh, because I put it through. Well, now I'm going to have white on there. I was so concerned about it not touching the other side. Uh, oh, well, what are you going to do? Okay. Tractor life, here we come. That's going to have some white in it. If I hate it, I'll do it again. <laughs> because I'm distracted by who's going to die on Game of Thrones because you know that people you love is going to die are going to get killed. Their heads chopped off if they're lucky. <laughs> I don't want Brianna to die. Bree? Is that her name? Brianna? I'm terrible with the names. And I certainly don't want I don't want little Tyrion. Type. What's his name? I can't pronounce his name. I'm terrible with the names. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, okay. You can only see the white. Awesome. I am so happy with the way this is coming out. I feel like it's just busy enough that I don't have to feel like the crazy um, over embellishing person. <sighs> you know, what I do wish we had, because how stinking cute would it be if we had little pigs and chickens to put around here? I was like, how can you give us a barn and not give us some pigs and chickens to put around? Um, I'm seeing some clouds in the future, possibly. We'll have to see what um, what I come up with next. But I love the way the details came out around here. This part here is my favorite. Just how we got the little details there. Made me happy to do that. I am done, people. Thank you, thank you so very much for being here and enjoying this fun um, activity with me. I really do love doing them. I hope to see you guys tomorrow. I'm going to be continuing my five from one equals more. I'm um, not telling you what transfer it's going to be, but it's going to be fun. And um, what else do I have coming up? I have my VIP live on Thursday night. I go live on Thursday in my VIP group. If you think that you would be interested in knowing more about Chocotor products, please just write more in, in that little area there that I'm not supposed to use the word, you can just write more. And you can, if you're interested in knowing more about Chocotour as a business, just put um, info, okay? So more for uh, my VIP group and info as a business. And I would be glad to get that information. Very low key, not a high pressure, not a, oh my gosh, I have your Facebook now, I'm gonna haunt you for the rest of your life. None of that at all. <laughs> so um, you let me know. And I am out of here. I'm gonna pull this down a little closer to the picture so that we can have that instead of my face that Facebook picks the bad pictures. So now I know how to pick a good picture. All right. Have a good night, people. Thanks so much.